The crowd has dwindled slightly, but is still present at this hour at Pioneer Courthouse Square. And Coin 6 is Jennifer Dowling. She's live now with a look at the scene tonight. How does it look tonight? Looks like most of that crowd has left tonight. It has. It's pretty chilly out here, but there are some folks who are persisting. You can see behind me there are around 30 to 40 that are still here at Pioneer Courthouse Square listening to some music and are just kind of hanging out, uh, ending their celebrations for the night on a, uh, a note of togetherness. Uh, a lot of people uh, uh, coming out this afternoon as well. Uh, there are a lot of people out here earlier in the night, too, carrying Black Lives Matter signs. And I talked to Alicia Warren about uh, why she particularly came down to the celebration just a couple hours ago. And she told me she was happy about the outcome of the election. She also added that she came out to exercise her Second Amendment rights in order to keep those who also came out to celebrate safe. I feel like things are going to change because of it, because of who's in office. Um, and not only that, our vice president, she looks like me. So as a black woman, she needs to stand up and stand out for people that look like her also. You know, um, I have two children and I don't want my kids to be killed at the hands of the cops. Kevin Peterson Jr. personally. His father coached my son in football, and my son's dad coached him in football. So that hits home. And there were some tense moments at tonight's celebration when a words Trump forever written on it pulled around the square. They drove by a few times and were approached by the crowd. It seems they drove off without further incident. And back out here. Square, a very peaceful situation. Uh, we did see some people that might have gone march, but it was a much smaller group than we typically see down here, and we haven't heard any kind of uh, uh, about any kind of traffic interruptions or anything like that. So, a relative in downtown Portland. Back to you.